guys <clears throat> good morning good man you know what man Uh, anyways, guys, I was talking to Officer Hicks, guys. Uh, apparently, guys, um, here we go, guys. We're running. Anyways, guys, we have two stolen vehicles. Uh, they have tracked here um, this Honda and a Sierra truck, guys. You can't see it. So we have the Honda. That nice Honda right there, guys. It's stolen uh, out of our agency. The white one is too. So there's two vehicles right now as we speak are stolen. And we're on a Ridgeview. You know, you got, um, so somewhere. Go ahead. <coughs> on a Kia. Come on. 316 from Crossroads to Metro Court. <coughs> nope, none of them was stolen over there. So we got two stolen vehicles parked right behind another one. Well, somebody's getting their vehicle back. That's a good thing. But anyways, guys, good morning. Like, good morning, good morning, good morning. So somebody's going to get their truck back and their Honda back. I think we were in the same, same area where we were last time that uh, a girl's phone was stolen and they were tracking it right here, <coughs> right here where I'm at. Might be all related, might be all related. Anyway, you guys, good morning, good morning, good morning. Metro is now Who gets arrested? Move your traffic back to Metro Dispatch. Metro is now 10-8. Move all traffic back to Metro Dispatch. Um, 
unfortunately, nobody gets arrested. Uh, they'll come out. They'll come out. The tech units. Uh, do a little fingerprint. Uh, they're parked on the side of the road. It doesn't mean if it's parked in front of the house. It belongs to those people, but um, unfortunately, um, unfortunately, they're going to this front house. Oh, we got another Honda. So now they're going into this house right here, guys. She was out here watering, watering the, watering the lawn. <clears throat> She was just out here too, guys. She was wandering down the uh, pavement. Two four one the temporary plate has expired. The permanent plate of six B bright yellow yellow nine eight three has been assigned. It returns on a 2013 Honda. Yeah, we have two stolen cars here. We have a Honda and a and a Sierra pickup. I think a GMC Sierra. Yeah, she doesn't want to come out no more because uh, the officers are looking over the fence and there's a couple vehicles back there uh, in their backyard. thing they could do is if it's in the backyard it really can't do nothing but they could run the place and see if they can get a search warrant to go inside that property uh oh code six guys are gonna need more officers Code 30 for now. Uh oh. This is one out of Metro Honda Cadet, baby, and Rodriguez. He's recently incarcerated for um, 3455. So, he was talking to somebody back there, guys. Apparently, he went in the house, closed the door, like he said. So, right now, we're at Code 6. Uh, there's a couple more officers are going to come. Let's uh, see if this guy comes out willing. I uh, hope he does. This thing could get bigger right here. We're on Ridgeview. Ridgeview over here on the, uh, on the east side of, uh, what's it called? Um, 
morning. Yeah, see, the, the, the lady was out here, guys, watering down her uh, her pavement. That you can see, it's all wet. Uh, with her baby. Uh, apparently, she went back in the house. She has not came out. Apparently, that guy was back there. Um, the officers were running some plates back there, but they came out. Uh, no stops. So. You no, know, he has a right. He, he, he doesn't want to talk to the officers. He don't want to talk to the officers. But uh, apparently, uh, they're going to push this. Okay. Uh, what's the code six? It's uh, we're going to need more units. So he has he he, he the all I, they have rights to um to search him because he's on probation. I was covered. He's been standing for thirty four years. Five nine two six. You black over breath. Sure. So he's also a documented top gang member. Metro one nine. Where's this at? We're on Ridgeview once again. Ridge, Riv, Ridgeview. Uh, the officer was hitting a low jack. Um, came up. They were looking for the GM Sierra. Um, when they came up, they located the vehicle. Uh, they ran more plates around the uh, the trucks on uh, the Honda that you see right there, guys. Also, it's stolen, too. How you doing, Sue? Uh, that, that young lady right there, guys, she's a ride along. She's a ride along. She wants to be an officer when she grows up. Trying to knock on the front door. Uh, she did open the door, guys. <clears throat> What's up, Johnny? Christina, I already, uh, <clears throat> I already said it like about 20 times. I know you just joined in, 
uh, maybe uh, we could pin it in the bottom, one of the mods. Apparently, uh, they hit a low jack. The officer was following the vehicle. Uh, he, f he located the vehicle over here on Ridgeview. Uh, apparently, they ran more plates. Uh, they found two, the, uh, the Honda that you see right there, the Honda and the white truck behind it, uh, they're stolen. So apparently, they're at this house and they're running. Uh, so right now they're checking this house right here uh, apparently um, whoever lives here he has he's on probation so they want to talk to the guy he doesn't want to talk to the officers what's up hand out Oh, look at that little doggy. You better get back in that little gate. Oh, he can barely walk. What's wrong with him? Oh, he can barely walk. What's wrong with that puppy? Oh, there he is. His leg's broken. Yeah, it looks like, well, he belongs to somebody. <coughs> Came out of that fence. Yeah, we'll get back in there. And there he is, right there, guys. One in custody. Doesn't mean that he's in custody. They're, they're still going to look, guys, uh, do a little investigation. Uh, it doesn't mean that he stole these cars, guys, but he's on probation, guys. Well, uh, the puppy's gone. He went back in. He knows where he lives at. Expired as of March of last year on a 2007 unknown make, phonetically Henry Yellow Ocean, Sam Robert, out of Bakersfield to Fabian Rodriguez. He is home already, Carla. He went under the fence. I don't want to get in trouble. Um, they think I'm still in a dog. I know uh, if I stole some vehicles, I sure wouldn't park it in front of my house. Tell you that right now. Control one, is <clears throat> Yeah, they need hard evidence to pin to pin this on him. Uh, they got to have video of him getting out of the vehicle. Um, don't know if there's any cameras. Eventually, uh, you know, these officers will canvas the area and see if there's any cameras on any houses. Uh, right now, he's just on uh, probation. You know, he didn't want to talk to the officers. Uh, the lady did let him go in the backyard inside the front house. So there was no way out.
They have fingerprints. Um, they'll come out here. The tech units, they're, um, they're already coming. They'll do some fingerprints. Stuff like that. Yeah, they do have some other vehicles in the back, guys. A motorcycle. Um, but everything came out clean. <clears throat> Good morning, John. Hey guys, we're here at Stolen Vehicles, guys. Apparently one of the officers um, hit a low jack. Um, he was trying to track it down from Niles and Morning. Uh, apparently um, over, over on Ridge, it's, it's right right up the street, guys, um, Niles. Um, apparently he was tracking it and tracking it. Um, the, uh, GM Sierra, um, looks like it's a four-door, located it, and then he ran some other plates, um, that Honda. Uh, came back stolen too. Stolen and if you guys recognize the Honda, uh, right now, unfortunately, we cannot see the truck. Uh, they're both in good shapes. No damage, nothing missing. And the, the owners will be uh, notified, guys, the vehicle has been found in. They'll come out here, give them a chance to come and get it. Uh, apparently, if they don't come and get it, they'll go to the tow yard. And they have to pay money. But if you guys recognize that Honda, and if it's yours, you better come and get it. Because <clears throat> you, you will be paying the tow fee. I think that's that's kind of stupid. Good morning, Carlene. Yeah, so far, yeah, the vehicles in the back come out clean.
Yeah, the officers, guys. Uh, I keep back, guys. Um, I don't. I'm not in their face or whatever. Um, they know I'm here. They know me. Um, they do their job. I'll let them. I don't go in their face like uh, what they call the auditors. Um, give them a hard time. I just kick back, park far away, and let them do their job. You know, some respect me, some don't. Uh oh, she's fighting, guys. They are arresting. I think they're arresting the mom, guys. Yep. They are arresting the mom, and the baby is crying, guys. It's terrible. It's terrible, guys. You know, it's terrible. The uh, baby's got to see that kind of stuff, and the baby's screaming because they're taking their mom. You know, hope a family member comes and gets um, her kids. I don't know how many kids are in there, but. From the first having PDL, I copy Edward 116752. This is 22, we're going to get you on second half, 10 8 route. Coming second hand through fire dispatch, only advising either at the tire shop or still something further. units attempting contact at 9323 Gladys Street. Um, the officers, uh, you know, officers, um, probably covering the baby. She's like three, four years old. Uh, what's it called? Uh, I don't know if I have any mods on here. I don't think so. I got a peg on. Uh, apparently, uh, one of the officers guys had, uh, hit a low jack. Uh, started for morning. He picked it up for morning in Niles. Um, he, hit it, he hit it over here on Ridgeview. So they pulled up, ran the plates. Uh, it was 100%. Uh, it was the pickup they were looking for. Also, the, that that gray Honda that you see right there is stolen too in front of this house. So they they went over there. Officers went over there. The guy didn't want to talk to the officers. He went inside the house. Um, and after that, they knocked on the front door. She opened it, went in. Apparently got him. They went in the back, arrested him. Uh, they ran her name. Apparently she has uh, warrants. Um, now she's in custody. You know, hope of family members. I hope they give. Oh, uh, they will. They give her a chance to call somebody. Uh, come and get the kids. Over a child custody 
Uh, what is the low jack? Uh, certain vehicles. Uh, certain vehicles have them. Only the sheriff's department. Uh, Air One. Uh, a low jack is a stolen vehicle from Air On. Uh, on Star. So they they hit it and they track it. Uh, and they tracked it right to this location right here. One Ridgeview. Over off morning. By morning in the Niles. They have um, when they run and somebody's on on probation or whatever at a house, guys. They have a right to go in there, guys, um, to do what they have to do. Um, if you're on probation, they ask you where you live at, and, and, you know, if you live here, at, and if you live here, uh, automatically. They have a right to go in that house. She, Lisa, she's a ride along. She wants to be an officer when she grows up. So she's getting the hands on hands experience. Uh, when she when she's when she's twenty one, um, we'll see we'll, we'll we will see her behind the wheel. Doing Liz, good morning. Apparently they're in the house searching too, guys. Unfortunately, um, I feel bad for the uh, the kids. <clears throat> I hope somebody comes out here. Um, you never know; they might s release her, give her a court date, get things straightened out.
Yeah, they're talking to her right now, guys. Like, she's in the back of the cop car, guys. We got two in custody. <clears throat> Apparently, they, you know, one has a warrant, one's on probation. Ooh. How many vehicles they have back there but he's still running some more back there guys <clears throat> What do you mean, Susan? What person? What person are you talking about? Because I'm not Central looking at the chair right now. How big is that backyard? I don't know. What there are? Uh, they just ran another one. How you doing, Samantha? Apparently, uh, you know, the officers uh, hit a low jack. Uh, they were uh, over on Morning and Niles. Uh, apparently, they located over on Ridgeview, Ridgeview Road. Uh, apparently, um, when he pulled up, he ran the uh, BIN number, it came out to be that GM Sierra. Uh, they ran more plates around here. Um, that Honda that you see right there also is stolen. Uh, they went to the neighbors. They went over here on this side. Around those plates. Uh, apparently, um, officers went back here. They seen some more vehicles. Ran the, those plates. They came out clean. <clears throat> apparently, there was a guy back there. Um, when they ran the address, apparently, uh, he's on probation. So they have automatically to uh, to search that that property. So apparently he's in custody. The female's in custody for warrants. Uh, right now they're trying to uh, see see, and it's going to be hard to pin these vehicles to them. They gotta they gotta have fingerprints, like I said, or video of them coming out of the vehicle. Um, they gotta do their homework. Good morning. 
Good morning, good morning. One. Texas Angel. Okay. Guys, be respectful over there on the YouTube side, guys. Please, guys. She's thirsty because the officer's bringing something. Give her something to drink. Well, that's what he's gonna do. Give her something to drink. get dry when you're upset that's when I always to be around cops you get cotton mouth Ack. no lie oh, ain't no lie right there uh, what's the call uh, two stolen vehicles you know, one officer was uh, tracking a low jack. Apparently he came up on the GM Sierra located and started running plates around it. They usually do. Um, they came out, the Honda to be stolen too. So, they'll get a hold of the, um, the owners. If they can't get a hold of the owners, they have to call the tow truck. Uh, and here it comes to speak of the devil. And here comes the tow trucks. And I didn't even hear them call the R RP or nothing. Oh, all bad, man. So this is what I hate. That's why I go live on this, guys. Uh, you know, if you recognize the vehicles, come and get your vehicles because if the, you know, it, they're gonna take it to the tow yard, guys. Uh, it's gonna cost you almost four hundred bucks to get your vehicle out. Yeah, that's terrible. Four hundred bucks, guys, and, and it's not you guys' fault. Uh, your vehicles get stolen. Um, when they call the tow truck out, guys, you're gonna pay a fee. He 
was lived there. He said, get out of my front yard. <laughs> Basically. What's this guy doing? He really wants me to get out of his his uh, parking. He backed all the way up, guys. He wants me to leave his air, his front yard, but yeah, it's a public street, but you know he, he's looking at me like, get out of my house. There it is right there, guys. See, why would they call it, see, why would they call the tow truck? Uh, Cody Glendon in 267 was en route as of 0814 with an ET of 30, occupying a purple Honda. The additional vehicle is being towed. Is uh, 264, is that the, the sedan or is this truck? It is sedan. So one owner is coming, guys. They get a, they got a hold of one owner. The other vehicle is getting towed away, guys. They'll be here in 30 minutes. I think they said it was out of uh, Lamont or Arvin. Look guys, they have keys. It's crazy. There's a key to that car. They have keys. That's crazy. It must be a shave key or something. You have, but it has a, um, you know, when you have keys, guys, and it has like, um, uh, like accessories to it. That is crazy. Yep, that's what they'll do, Barbara. 
Exactly. You know, if it stays in the tow yard for a week, you imagine that bill. Ooh, you're looking at $1,000 right there. That's storage fees. trying to get it started one. you know some Hondas have a chip guys uh, I don't know if the new ones do do the new uh, new Hondas have chips guys you gotta rub it like on the side before you start it The signal on, oh, guys. So, I guess they're gonna uh, end up moving this vehicle out of the way. I don't know why they don't move the officer's vehicle or they have to grab it from the front. Oh, they're here, guys. They're here to get their vehicle. Yep. Well, oh, they found another vehicle, guys. Yep, took the plates off over here. All over the Honda tonight, sir. Get your answer. So he, he has, you can see right there, the officer has plates off the other vehicle up the street, guys. That's crazy. It's just nuts. Here, guys, we're losing signal, guys. Hey, hello, Daddy. Hey, David, 60, go ahead. B10A in vehicle 1804, J61, we'll be ready with. So they, 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 they come for the Honda guys, uh, the owner, they can't get a hold of the owner of the truck. So they're going to tow the truck away, the, uh, the owners of the Honda are here. Right now they're going to jump it because the battery's dead. Let's see if that's the case. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, I already 
you know, you really got it going. That was quick. Yes, so yeah. one of the officers um, hit a low jack on Morning in Niles. Um, he was tracking it. He tracked it over here on Ridgeview. Um, apparently, when he came up on the vehicle on the truck on the Sierra, um, he ran the plate to the Honda. The Honda came back stolen also. Apparently, uh, they went to this house. Uh, they ran the house. Apparently, uh, the guy is on probation. When he was in the backyard, he didn't want to talk to the officers. He went back into the house. Um, the lady opened the front door. They went in the back because they have a right. Uh, if he's on probation, they they have a right to go in that house uh, without a warrant. So they went in the back, took him into custody, uh, ran her name. She has warrants. She's in custody. Uh, apparently... Um, both in custody uh, right now one of the ho the uh, owner of the car the Honda she's here to pick up the vehicle uh, the truck's gonna get towed away No. Yeah, she left her whole keys in there. Offered some barely could fit in that car. It says F out. Copy, thanks. Link 13, Charlie 6. No, it's the uh, tow truck. Confirm she's playing up foot this time out of motorcycle. It's the tow truck, guys. It's a diesel. Control one, Tom, 24, 10, 16, let it go. 24, 10, 16. Oh, they pulled it to the side. Uh, right now, they're trying to get to um, to the truck. It has a bike back there in the, in the GM Sierra. So he was riding the bike, stole the vehicle, threw the bike in the back of the truck. Structure fire, station fire. 
Yeah, there's uh, in front of that truck. There's a driveway. Yeah, there's a driveway and there's another pickup there. And there's a fortunately there's a car behind me, and I'm right on the bumper. Apparently there's uh, David, 25, six, thank God there's four. people at the house too, guys. So, so far we haven't heard nothing about come and get the kids or nothing like that. That's a good sign. A girl on a, on a quad. So right now, guys. That's it right there, guys. That's the truck. Another stolen vehicle. Stolen vehicle recovered. It's just all over the place. Dakota Freysis. Ten four. Our code four. Okay, guys. Well, guys, I am going to shut down, guys, but anything does come up, guys, we'll be listening to the scanner. Until then, guys, I do appreciate you guys joining in for this little adventure right here. The sto two stolen vehicles are recovered, guys. Uh, one, one owner is here for the Honda, uh, not the uh, GM Sierra. They'll be going to the tow yard, junkyard, or whatever. Uh, and that's that's terrible, guys. But I will catch you guys on the next one, guys. Thank you, Mods. Appreciate you guys. I'll see you guys on the next one, guys. California 8, Charles, Ian, Sam, 5-1.